previously on Hell's Kitchen. I know you crazy. Don't fucking call me crazy. After <laughs> battling with her teammates. Press the bell, bitch, because we can argue. Don't call me bitch, bitch. And being confronted with an early morning wake up. Get up! Good morning, gentlemen. Get up there. Get up! Get moving. Gina made a startling announcement. I'm going to be leaving. If you can't stand the heat, get out the kitchen. Let's go. Then, in a challenge designed to test teamwork, oh, the men conquered the wall and captured more lobsters. How many lobsters are in there? 37. Yeah. Stop. But the red team pulled together where it counted most. Come on, ladies. In the kitchen. Nine, 10, 11. And won yet again at dinner service. What's the first thing you taste? Mary. White wine. Just a few squid, chef. Ugh. And Danielle. You have to burn off the alcohol. Couldn't handle their liquor on the app station. Have you got a drinking problem? I mean, this is hard. Someone teach these two idiots how to make a fucking risotto. Yes, yes, chef. And Janelle had to bail them out. Mary, are you watching what I'm doing? Let's go, then. In the blue kitchen. I told you I'm having a hard time. I apologize. Christian stumbled on scallops. Rubber fucking scallops. Christian, stop dicking me around. While Jeremy stumbled on everything. What's he doing? Jeremy, he's moving in first and second gear all the time. In the end, neither the blue team. Get out! Wow. Get the fuck out of here! Nor the red team. Get out! I'm done! Could complete service. Both kitchens were a disaster. And each team had to pick two for elimination. The men nominated. Jeremy. And. Christian. While the women chose. Mary. And. Danielle. With emotions running high. My decision is, Christian, give me a jacket, big boy. Christian's dream of becoming head chef of Gordon Ramsay Pub and Grill at Caesar's Palace went up in flames. Continuation of Hell's Kitchen. Get out of here. Jeremy, come here, you. I'm getting a little worried about you. Have you lost your fight? No, sure. You need to find your voice. Don't get crushed. I won't let you down, I promise. Get out of here. Yes, sure. Clearly, Chef Ramsay sees something in me that my team doesn't. They don't see it. I don't know why they don't see it. What do he say to you? What a shit, dude. Speak to much. Let me spit it up. Let me spit it up. I've been so quiet because I'm trying to see how you guys all interact. And what's happening, you all talk too fucking much. I can't get a word in size-wise about anything. I'm going to speak up more, and you guys are going to hear me more. You stepping up and just opening your fucking mouth right now is the progression we're looking for. I'm still not 100% confident in Jeremy. Man, he's a fucking liability. I'm gonna start pushing a lot harder. We want that's you that's all we want That's all we want, dude. That's yeah. all we want. It. Now bring it out, show. Hey, I just want to say, Danielle, I'm glad that you're still here. If I can help you with anything, let me know. I just got to grasp this shit, you know? And Mary, the same thing for yeah. you. I'm glad that you're fighting, and he can see it. So just don't give up. It's a freaking wake up call. Like, I can't get up there anymore. If I do, I could go home, and I'm not ready to go home. After a horrific dinner service, followed by a night of team bonding. Come on, guys. Chef Ramsay wants you all downstairs right now. OK. Chef Ramsay has an early morning. Run, Come run, on. run. Surprise. Oh, shit. Oh, holy fucking shit. There are runners lined up. And are we going to have to run a marathon? I can't do that. 
I've run over a dozen marathons in my life. And I reached out to my friends at the N Play Foundation, and we have organized the most amazing first ever HK 3K to raise awareness of childhood obesity. I'm ready to run 3K. Let's save those little fat kids. We are honored to have some very special guests. A gold medal winner from the 2000 Olympic Games crowned the fastest man on the planet, oh. Morris Green. How are you? How are you? That is so cool. The first female American to win six medals in one Olympics. Oh. Give a warm welcome to Natalie Colton. Wow, Natalie's beautiful. And we have one more guest. He is a world champion and Olympic medalist, Danel Leva. Thank you so much for joining us. This Olympics gymnast, he is poo, 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 mucho caliente. He is fine as hell. For today's challenge, after the run, our guests, along with our amazing runners, will be heading straight in to Hell's Kitchen for the most amazing lunch. The first team to complete and feed their side of the restaurant will win this challenge. Chefs, are you ready? Yes, yes chef. chef. Fuck, I have to run in my chef's shoes. This is going to be hard. Come over and join us. Stop. How on earth is lunch going to be ready if you're out running with us? Seriously. <laughs> <laughs> so I would like a volunteer, one from the blue team and one from the red team. The rest of you will be getting the menu ready. But you can't start your first ticket until your entire team is back in the kitchen. Ladies. Oh, I'll run. Uh, Mary, come on down, Mary. Let's go. Oh, boy. I'm a little out of shape, but I'm hoping that I can redeem myself by doing this in some way. Our blue team. Dan, let's go. I'm all legs. I'm pretty sure I could run this backwards and beat Mary. Everybody ready? <laughs> Runners on your mark, set. Go, bro. <laughs> Dan, Dan, so Dan. <laughs> Come on, come on, come on, come on. Today's HK 3K run has a checkpoint where Mary and Dan can inform their kitchens of their progress. In the meantime, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. The rest of their teammates are already busy prepping lunch for the hungry runners. I have all the burger meat set up. The menu includes a grilled flank steak wrap, a pan seared salmon, and an edamame portobello burger, all served with sweet potato fries. Come on, come hustle on. Up, hustle up. Back on the corpse. Well done. Keep it going. Dan approaches guys, the checkpoint. How you doing, man? How far away are you? Come on, come on. I'm one third of the way there. Let's go. Smile. smile. We have like no time, dude. With one kilometer down, the blue team hurries to complete their prep. Come on, come on. Hustle up, hustle up. But the red team still hasn't received a check in. I don't know about Mary. From their runner. Mary? Where's Mary? <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is really, really hard. I'm so tired. Hey you guys, I've got like, I'd say 10 or 7 minutes. I'm sorry, I'm so slow. I'm going to at least make it to the end of the road. Are a lot of people in front of you? Everybody, I'm like the last one. Just keep going, keep going. Guys, Mary just made it to the first K. Mary checked in, thank God. Where's Mary? Mary. I could skip, prance through a meadow, prance back, and still win. Dan's back, guys. Dan's, Dan's back. back. Right, come on. Guys, 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 I can hear Dan. He's back. Crap. What's on the menu? Bring me up. While the blue team gets Dan up to speed. Dan, come here. I'm going to go over it with you. All right, cool. Perfect. Mary inches closer to the finish line. <laughs> and finishers begin filing into Hell's Kitchen, eager for their lunch. I need yeah, to I'm eat. Hey. OK, Jean-Philippe, let's feed our amazing runners. Let's go, yeah? Blue team, ready to go? Yes, yes. Yes. Yeah. yeah. On order, four covers, table one, six smoothies, six salads. Everybody needs a smoothie salad before their next course, right? Yes, yes. Let's yeah. go. The salad and the smoothies. We are off to a head start. We can win this challenge. There's no reason we can't get a lunch service off. How long are them smoothies, Jeremy? I'm already going. Is that, is that, is that cooked? No, chef, it's seared. It's not cooked, though. Bring it over? Surely a piece of salmon that small can be cooked to order. Who cooked these off? I did, chef. Why? If there's one fish we don't cook twice, come on, guys. What the fuck? Are you kidding me? Are we looking at a fast food fucking diner? No, no chef. chef. Start again, Zach. OK, chef. Christ. Six smoothies, six salads, come on. How long on those Three smoothies? Salads. Tell me. I'm blending them now. 
Oh, I found my voice, and my team knows it. Pump this out. Right. Three salads walking. Zach may have jumped the gun on the salmon, but the men are now back on track. Let's go. And are getting appetizers out to their diners. Good, bro. Meanwhile, in the red kitchen. You all right, Mama? Yeah. Mary is back. Yeah. OK, where am I? But she's a little out of it. I didn't let my team down because I ran the whole way, but I'm just exhausted. Is all of it cooked yet? Or? No. Mary, she looks like death warmed over. Got this, got this. Ladies, blue team have already served, guys, huh? Yes, chef. Six up the table, 30. Six smoothies, six salads. Go! Yes, 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 yes. Let's go. I make smoothies daily. I'm the smoothie queen, so I can pretty much guarantee they're going to be good to go. Come on, smoothies. Let's go. Clean the rim, clean the rim. Finesse. Susan, pour with some finesse. Yes, chef. You're slowing down the fucking kitchen because you're acting like a slob. Because I can't plate the smoothies. I need to cook. I need to cook them. The smoothies, you gonna have to cook. Home girl, you better start thinking. Where are the smoothies? I'm gonna go over there and help her so this bitch can get her smoothies out on time. What you need? Load this up with ice. While Nedra helps Susan with smoothies, back in the blue kitchen, Jeremy and Ray come and throw with smoothies. Make a hole, guys. Complete their appetizers. Two wrap one time one burger. And the men move on to entrees. I'm watching fries, OK? Of course we're killing it right now. We need to win this. We got this, man. In the red kitchen. Go, please. Thanks to Nedra's help on smoothies. No more. We're done. Walking down wraps. The women are now ready to send out their first entrees. Three wraps, one burger. Well, almost ready. Fries. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Coming right now. How can we fuck up with fries? Chef, there's only two fry baskets. You can't make them fry any quicker. It's the laws of physics. You're getting fucking screwed with fries. Fries, I've got to complete the table. Yes, 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 yes chef. Come on. Why is that food dying? Fries, fries, fries. Keep fries, the fries going. Go. Take them straight to the pass. Sorry, fries, chef. Fries, chef. Danielle has finally delivered on the fries. Let's go. And entrees are delivered to hungry diners. Go. Meanwhile, the blue team is also pushing out plates. Two wrap, two salmon, one burger. Pick yes, it up, sir. guys. Yes, yes, Determined to win their first challenge. Three tickets to go. They've got four tickets, though. Come on! Come on. Yeah. We got this fucking challenge, OK? Let's go. The blue team is going to win this challenge. Coming down behind, 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 behind. Wraps in the window. No salmon. You're almost done on them salmon. I'm ready. I'm ready. Go, 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 go. go, 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 go. Behind, behind, behind. Oh. It's raw. It's raw. Are you fucking serious? Zach, the salmon's raw. I've got eight-year-old girls in the dining room. The salmon's raw. Raw. Start again. Oh, Jesus. Chef told me that I can't use the fish that I had just cooked off, but the salmon looked perfect. So I figured all I got to do is finish it off and send it out. Where's this from? That's the old stuff, Chef. That's the old stuff? Yes, Chef. Have we been using that? No, chef. Have we, Zach? No, chef. We're doing the thing straight to the order. The truth? Yes, chef. That's why they're still there, chef. Zach, Chef Ramsey's not stupid. He knows. He knows what's going on. Look at me in the fucking eyes. Did you take salmon from the back and reheat it? I tried I, to. I, yes or no? No, chef. It's right here. Shut the fuck up. Fuck off off the salmon. Somebody else cooked the fucking salmon. Jeremy, jump on. While Jeremy starts over on salmon, Back in the red kitchen. Two tables left. I have another wrap. The women are closing in on the finish line. Down wraps. One more bowl of fries. 20 seconds. Let's go. You got it, mama. Blue team, salmon to complete the table. Last ticket. Yes, chef. Plates, 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 plates. I need plates. So we need French fries. Come on, Danny. Service, please. Fries. Ladies, well done. Thank you, chef. Yes, yes, yes. Woo, red team. We are dominating the boys. Do me a big favor. Get in the blue team and help the men. Let's go. What do you need, guys? Salmon. Salmon. There's no fucking silver lining at all to this. We started off great, and then it just went. It's all Zach's fault. Where's the salmon? I got it, Chef. Let's do it. With the women coming to the rescue on the fish station. It's done. Service. The men finally serve their last table. There we go. Hey, blue team. Fucking embarrassing. Guys, line up, let's go. Yes, yes chef. chef. Red team, you work like a freaking team. And when you make mistakes, you bounce back. Your reward is simply amazing. 
all of you are going to be heading off to California's lush wine country. <laughs> There's one more thing. Your private jet <laughs> is about to taxi down the runway and get out of there. Well done. Never in my life have I flown on a private jet. No. We feeling like a G6. <laughs> OK, where's the spirit gone, guys? What's happening, blue team? Everyone's scared to step up and work together. Chef, we're just fucking lost. Yeah. OK. You know what might help us during service? The tickets. Could it be slowed down just so everybody could hear it and repeat it? No. no. Oh, my God. Don't ask stupid questions. I'm sorry, guys. It's not difficult. But do you know what, Michael? Here's what I'm going to do. Tomorrow night's service, I'm going to call the tickets out slower. But what I'm asking is, please, work together. OK. While the red team are jetting off, your feet will be firmly planted on the ground. I want that HK 3K route entirely cleaned. Break down the checkpoints, pick up the trash. I want all that paint scrubbed off. I want the kitchens prepped as well. Yes, Chef. Yes, Chef. Get out, guys. Yes, chef. I'm over this. I don't get a private jet. I get to go clean up a 3K racetrack. This sucks. Coming through, coming through. Woo! Woo! Sorry, guys. At least you're getting some sun. Rub it in. Just, just, just salt on the wound. Just a little bit of salt. Just a pinch. Go fuck yourself. how to make us feel like VIP. <laughs> this is so awesome. <laughs> Have any of you bitches ever lost a challenge? No! <laughs> <laughs> I'd rather be sitting on a plane. Oh, fuck me, man. Why are these things not going away? Scrubbing those arrows off the concrete. Oh, God. The fucking worst. This fucking ground is hot as shit. Ah. Hey, look at me, Mom. I'm on a chain gang. God. It just kept scrubbing and scrubbing and scrubbing. Hot, scrubbing, scrubbing, scrubbing. This shit sucks. Oh, my God, it's so this gorgeous out here. This oh is amazing. Oh Wine country is absolutely beautiful. The lunch spread of cheese and wine is Fucking sexy. We yes, really, really came did. together today. Just when I think it can't get any better, <laughs> it totally does. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted to squish grapes with my feet. <laughs> <laughs> Squishy, it's sticky. It's the perfect reward, the perfect experience. We squashed the competition. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know about you, but I'm really fucking done losing. Absolutely. Yep. You know, let's hustle, all right? I don't want to be down here for fucking five hours. <laughs> uh oh, guys. Well, oh, don't they, look. Don't, keep keep going. Keep working. Hey, guys. Hey. Hey. You guys still sweating hey. your balls off? You coming doing, in. Guys? Coming in. When I come back in, there's a skank parade coming through. Holla, 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 holla. Girls, move. We're, we're working, guys. Can you move? We're trying to work. Don't be rude. Get the yeah. fuck out. With their third consecutive challenge loss under their belts, the men start prep. Close this up, fellas. Determined to achieve their first dinner service win. And Michael. Who's doing the fish? I got it. Is leading the charge. I'll help you. Meanwhile, in the red kitchen, one chef. Where's the Roboku base? Is falling behind. I don't know. I feel like hesitant, you know, to speak up. Speak up, girl. That's all. That's it. Danielle definitely needs to gain a little more confidence. Being silent is worse than being wrong. We have to win tonight. We have to fucking win. While Danielle struggles to find her voice, back on the blue side. Dan, please don't leave your stuff on my fucking station. Dan has no problem speaking his mind. Oh, you're breaking my balls, man. You're breaking my balls. As it stands right now, I think I need to keep a really close eye on Dan. There's no eggs in here. I'm confused. Oh, my god. Dan, he's just lost in the sauce. He doesn't pay attention. He doesn't look at what he's doing. We're not even under the gun yet. Dan, what is this? Watercress. No, it's not. 
I have watercress. Wow, I'm doing watercress right now. This is the fucking uh, Swiss char. We don't want to fuck our team. Michael, you're being a pain in my ass, so step off. And don't make me look like an asshole. Oh, you're fucking not in charge of me. All right? Wait. Listen, we got service we're going to worry about. suck my fucking dick. You're not my goddamn boss, OK? Uh, 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 stop. Gentlemen, ladies, let's go. OK, tonight is the night. Third service, and we're going to do a tableside stunning Greek salad. I'd like Cindy in the dining room. Men, Jeremy. Set up on your stations. Let's go, guys. Yes, chef. Jean Philippe. Oui, chef. Open Hell's Kitchen, please. Let's oui, go. Chef. This is going to be fast, but it's going to be fun. Everybody ready? We can do this. We can Check do this. Hell's Kitchen opens for the third dinner service. If you spin it nicely, put a bit of a show act. And once again, Hell's Kitchen is the place to be in Los Angeles. How so are nice you? to see you. Welcome. To meet you. Oh, thank thank you. you so much for coming. Oh, thank you for having us. It's Christy Yamaguchi out there. <gasps> oh, my god. OK, ladies, here we go. One salad special, one scallop, two risotto, entree, one chicken, one lamb, two Wellington. Yes, yes, chef. Blue team, first ticket away. Here we go. Four covers, table 22. Appetizers, one salad, table side, two risotto. One Caesar salad. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. Michael. Yes, chef. How was that for you? Fine, chef. Raymond. Yes, chef. How was that for you? Perfect, chef. Slow enough? Yes, chef. chef. Okay. You know what might help us during service? The tickets. Could it be slowed down just so everybody could hear it and repeat it? I mean, fucking hell. A little nervous about Ray. I'm not going to fucking lie. 51 years old. Memory's really not there. Listen, I got three minutes. I got two minutes, OK? Dinner service, there's no fucking room for error. Special risotto, Caesar, where is it? Caesar's coming up, risotto's coming to the window. Let's go. I need go a little risotto started. Go, Ray. Here you go, Chef. I know how to cook a good risotto. There's no reason, no reason, we shouldn't have perfect risottos all the time. Service, please. Guys, we got this. You're doing a great job. Uh, Mr. Hollins. Appreciate it. Despite his teammates' concerns, Ray's risotto has gotten the men off to a good start. Oh, come on. Now, it's up to Jeremy in the dining room. You run into me. Uh... Sorry. To keep up the momentum. Hello, and welcome to Hell's Kitchen. Who ordered the Caesar? I mean, the Greek. Whoopsie. We just give it a little bit of room, and this is so embarrassing, you have no idea. Oh, my goodness, it's not spinning for me. While Jeremy struggles with the table-side salad. Uh -huh. In the red kitchen. Walking. Susan has no trouble delivering her appetizers. Nice. Our scallops are beautifully cooked. Let's go. Thank you, chef. Service, please. And the red team is in perfect sync with Cindy serving her Greek salad to an Olympic gold medalist. Greek salad, Hell's Kitchen style. The diners on the red side are enjoying their appetizers. Mm. Meanwhile, on the blue side of the dining room. How's everything, though? Um, the rice was a little hard. Shall we have the chef doing a, a new one for you? Please. It's a slightly different story. Can I go on the scallops again now? Start it. Uh, chef, uh, VIP table, NBA player. The risotto is too hard. Risotto, a VIP table. Rice fucking undercooked. Hey, hey, sure. he's a bit. Hey, come here, you. Give me that pan. Give me that pan. Sure. What are you doing? That one, what, 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 just what in the fuck are we doing? Things are rolling, risotto goes out. Awesome, perfect, good, good start. That's burnt and that's hot. I'll put another one in, Chef. Risotto comes back, awesome, perfect. This is what we do. You, you, granddad, come on, this is the pickup now. 10 seconds, Chef, right here, Chef. Chef Ray, watch your motherfucking self. And you better not make any more mistakes under the fucking sun, you hear me? Keep the fucking pan down! Yes, Chef. I understand, Chef. You're getting confused here. Move, Ray! Sorry. Ray, get your head out of your ass and get this risotto out. We're waiting on you. Waiting on Ray. Stop! Risotto, tastes delicious. Now you've raised the bar. Thank you, Chef. Hey. Don't piss your pants. I won't, Chef. Just stay focused. Yes, Chef. Bring it on. I'll make you proud of me. Let's cook some more shit here. Yeah, I mean, not shit. Excuse me. Better, yeah? Better. 
while Ray rebounds on risotto. Way to bounce back, Ray. Way to bounce back, man. You're doing fantastic, dude. Chef Ramsey is looking to Jessica on appetizers. Two special, two capellini, one risotto, one scallop. How long? To keep things moving in the red kitchen. Six minutes, Chef. Good, let's go. Let me know when you need the scallops, OK? Is that one order or two? We're good. We're. I'm like baffled. That is a huge portion of risotto. Scallops walking. Jeff Ramsey will not tolerate that shit. Where's the risotto? Where's the risotto, scallops? Risotto, risotto. Two minutes for risotto. Jessica. Yes, chef. Do you have a second gear? Yes, chef. I want to see it. Then let's yes, go. Chef. Fucking crazy, bitch. I don't know what's wrong with Jessica, but get your shit together, home girl. Come on, bitch. Get your shit together. Walking with the risotto. One risotto. Why is she cooking all that? Oh, all of you. How many portions are in there? Three. Three Four. chefs. Three. Four. Five. How many's going? Two chefs. One. Is this a joke for you? No, chef. All that time we're waiting. Sorry, chef. Five portions of fucking risotto. I need one. Let's go, bounce back. Yeah. While the women try to sort out their issues on appetizers. Come on, guys. Let's pick it up. Let's keep going. Throw five. Serve one. The blue team. What? Up as a team. Three Wellington chef. Go, please. Has moved on to entrees. Go, please. Two fast, one chicken, one lamb. How long? One minute, chef. I'm going to start my plot. Yeah, start your plot. You do that, baby. Now, the spotlight is on Dan on meat and Michael on garnish to keep them moving. Lamb garnish. Lamb garnish, chef. Lamb. Dude, this is under. I can't stand this. Lamb. Walk with the lamb, please. Lamb's not done yet, Jeff. Oh, fuck. Oh, Christ almighty. It's still rare in the middle. The middle piece is rare. The outsides are good. Oh, fuck me. I'm going to have to fire all new garnish. Where? The lamb's not cooked. Where? Brand new garnish. Michael, just sit there and wait. I got it. Where is this fucking lamb? Right here, Chef. Right here, Chef. There's the fucking plates. Two minutes to be sat there, dress. Lamb is being cut, it's on its way. Walking lamb. Behind. Oh, it's there, hey, Bozo, that's why I opened the fucking gap for you. Yes, Chef. Two lamb, Chef. Yelling over, problem solved, right? You, hey, string bean, come here. Yes, Chef. Wrong. What the fuck is that? Get lamb going now. What is that? What, what is that? Shit, Jeff. This thing's one more minute in the oven, and that bit there should be a fucking dog shoe. Yes, Chef. Your garnish is being restarted for the 60th time. Here I go. I have to do my job again. While Dan tries once again to correctly cook the lamb. Lamb, lamb, lamb. In the red kitchen. Where's the chicken? Coming, Chef. Jacqueline and Danielle on meat are ready to show Chef Ramsay they know what they're doing. Where would you like to try? Yeah. Thank you, Chef. Big fucking chicken. Ladies! Yes, yes Chef! Yeah. Pink chicken. Oh, fuck. Raw chicken? Like, seriously? Pink chicken, undercooked, and pink. Sorry, Chef. Wait, oh, come yes, on, Jacqueline! Yes, Chef, yes, Chef. Yes, chef. Bounce back, guys. Leave it Jacqueline. in the water longer. Get me a pan. Jacqueline! Yes, Chef! There's certain things you can't do in the kitchen. Yes, Chef. And that's sort of raw chicken. Yes, Chef. Jesus Christ! I need help slicing this really bad. I, I, my hands are too fucking jittery. I'm stressing like a motherfucker. Put it down. OK, jumping over. Service, please. Despite the jitters, Jacqueline's second attempt at the chicken has satisfied Chef Ramsay. She is really good. good. And the diners. Meanwhile, half of the diners on the blue side have received their entrees, but the other half is very hungry and growing impatient. And Chef Ramsay is still waiting for. Lamb! Where is the lamb? It's bringing up, Chef. It's about a minute left, Chef. Come on, I'm going to lose those garnish. A minute away. Garnish is done. I'm doing fucking 50,000 things right now, and Dan's failing at the one fucking task that he has. I need a lamb. Jack, huh? Motherfucker. OK, the lamb wasn't cooking fast enough. What the fuck do you want me to do about it other than put it in the damn oven? Dan, real time. How long? 
How long? You just looked at the fucking lamb. How long? Move. Jesus, fuck. Then he asked Zach, how long? Are you kidding me? How does Zach know? Get the fuck out of here. Get out. Really? If he lays one fucking finger on me, I'm going to beat him all over the fucking room. I don't care if I fucking go to jail tonight. Dan, don't stand there. Hey, come on. Jesus. Split up. Fucking bump me again. I, 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 don't bump me. You ain't shit. You want to fucking fight? Come get it. I, 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 you, I, you, I, fuck with Come here, you. Come here. Ooh, someone's getting it now. What the fuck is going on with you two? You got to talk to me, bro. That's it. All right. You got to fucking talk right, to stop me. Stop yelling at me. No. Stop yelling. Fuck you. Talk to me or get the fuck out and go home. You're throwing him under the bus you got every me. fucking time. I'm You're sorry, fucking me, dude. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Well, look up and talk to I'll each other. I'll fix it. I'm sorry. Let's do it. Got Come it. on. I'm ready on garnish. Thank you. You're ready on garnish? I'm ready for garnish. Thank you. To refire. I fucking speak English. You're just a little fucking baby. Oh, no. Dan's pissing me off. Meh, 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 meh. Hold on. Two lamb. How long? One minute? One oh. minute. Thank you, Dan. Hey, smile. The sarcasm is not appreciated right now. I really don't appreciate you not knowing how to cook food. Don't even talk. Don't even talk. Just cook, bro. That's all I want you to do. You're not fuck. All right, good, great. If it took me an hour to do the fucking ticket, I'd get fucking fired. Yes, chef. Two lamb, chef. Finally, redemption. Go. Finally, Dan's lamb has left the kitchen. Tender. And in the red kitchen, the pressure is still on the meat station. Entree for Port One Wellington. Walking with the Wellington. Now it's overcooked. Hey, perfect. All of you, hey. Oh my God. Jacqueline and Danielle are both crashing and burning. Every single thing keeps coming back. We can't get past it. The red team that love taking the piss because they've flown on a private jet, they've been on a fucking mega super yacht, and they think they're King Dick because they kissed Celine Dion's ass in fucking Vegas. Come here, you. Touch that. It's overcooked, chef. Yes, chef, overcooked. Just uh, Oh, she disappears. Look, hey. I'm hey, getting you hey, another you. one, chef. I understand it's overcooked. Look at that there. Touch that yes, there. Yes, chef. Sorry, chef. Here's I need another even before one. touching that one, what do you think that one's going to come out at? Medium, chef. Touch that one. Overcooked, chef. Overcooked. Over. Oh, damn. Danielle, girl, get your shit together, man. Third time lucky. Bingo. Perfect, chef. Perfect, uh, chef. Per per perfect, chef. Sorry, chef. So the first two were what? My fuck up, chef. Sorry, chef. Danielle has finally managed to deliver a properly cooked Wellington. Service, please. And two and a half hours into dinner yeah. service. Right behind you, Barbie Dow. Both the red team. Ladies, we are going to finish the service. Keep going. Do what you can. Keep it moving. And the blue team. Just keep fucking rocking. Go. Have managed to feed all their diners. Good. That's it. We finished a full fucking service. We bounced back a whole bunch of times. Won a big old hurrah for that. OK. Now. Both teams did complete dinner service, but I am not celebrating. We have a lot of issues. But there was one kitchen that made some progress, and they are tonight's winning team, the blue team. Yeah! Yes! Get out, guys. Yes, sir. Blue team! Ladies, tonight's performance was dreadful. Overcooked, undercooked your worst service. Now, give me two names that you think should leave House Kitchen. Now, fuck off. Yes, yes, chef. Yes, chef. Yes, yes, chef. Oh, my god. I can't believe we lost. Losing dinner service to the boys is disgusting. I honestly feel like the thing that really fucked us up the most was the meat station. I mean, literally, Danielle and all the Wellingtons were overcooked. I think that Jacqueline deserves to fucking be on the chopping block tonight. I just think that's a bunch of bullshit. Homegirl right here, Jacqueline, she's strong as a motherfucker. If we vote her off, we stupid as hell. I swear to God, we is. Danielle, I'm obviously voting for you. We asked you to step up, and that didn't happen. I was more vocal tonight. I've been telling all of you from the get-go that this is a new fucking environment for me. I have to learn it. 
And I think it's unfair to fucking throw me under the bus. Danielle is screaming, but it's like, where's this fucking passion when you're sinking? This is what we've all been asking for. You know, Jessica on apps, I think there was problems coming out of the gate. I did have risotto come back, but I feel like tonight went a lot smoother. You, Jessica, I saw you second guessing yourself a million times with risotto, and you have to just trust yourself and know. All I know is I did well, so what the fuck is going on right now? At no point in time was Jessica confident. Yeah. My lack of confidence this is my first time on the fucking station. Anybody is shaking sometimes. I almost feel like I'm betrayed by my team. I just don't think it's fair. It's just a bunch of crap. So who's been nominated? We've got Jacqueline, we've got Danielle, and we've got Jessica. I really don't know who the second choice needs to be. Okay, ladies, have you reached a decision? Yes, yes, Chef. Good. Amanda? Yes, Chef. First nominee and why? Our first nominee, Chef, is Danielle. She can't show us that she knows how to be a leader, Chef. Second nominee and why? Jessica, Chef. The team feels that Jessica might be in over her head. Okay. Danielle, Jessica, step forward, please. Do you know what? There's one more chef that I would like to hear from. Because she could have killed somebody tonight. Jacqueline, get your ass up here. I mean, honestly, Miss Pink Chicken, unacceptable. Jessica. Yes, yeah, chef. Why do they want you out? My team believes that I am not confident in my ability. So, Nedra, Jessica's not a good teammate. Explain that to me. Um. Earth to Nedra. You nominated her, but you can't tell me why. I mean, hello? Jessica. Yeah, Chef. Back in line. Thank you, Chef. Danielle, you had extra Wellingtons, yet you still sent me overcooked. Where is the middle ground? It's just taking me a little bit longer to grasp the whole way that things work here. My performance here in three nights of service does not describe my ability as a chef. I'm a damn good chef, and I know that. Jacqueline, why do you think you should stay in Hell's Kitchen? I think I should stay in Hell's Kitchen because I'm born to do this. I've been doing this all my life. You're born to cook pink chicken. No, I'm not born to cook pink chicken, chef. I'm no. born to cook. This is what I, my body's meant to do. I just want to be here. I deserve to be here. I should have thrown you out in the middle of service. I'm in a very difficult scenario. My decision is... Jacqueline, back in line. <laughs> Danielle, give me your jacket. Your time is done. You never really improved, in my mind, in free service. I'm sorry. Thank you for Three strikes, you. and you're out. Thank you. Good night. Jeff Ramsey, I'm sorry that you didn't get the opportunity to see me in my true form. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to pick up and grasp this kitchen as quickly as expected. I'm very thankful and I'm grateful that I made it this far. I just wish that I had made it further. Ladies, you are not the same outfit that opened this competition. Let me tell you, if you think what you've been through is challenging so far, I, I'm going to turn up the heat because I need to start separating the chefs from the cooks. Got it? Yes, yes chef. chef. Piss off. Tonight, I dodged a bullet. Thank you, baby Jesus. I'm still here. Thank you. Dan's a fucking amateur. I got to get this guy off this fucking team if we're going to be successful. Going into our next dinner service. He needs to go the fuck home. 
I'm not here to make best friends. So these girls better watch out because I'm definitely going to get them next time around. Every dinner service, Danielle looked like a deer in the headlights. And that's why she ended up as dead meat. Next time. The pressure of Hell's Kitchen uh, you right? threatens to push one chef out the door. You right, dude? And into early retirement. I want to win, but I don't want to die. And sends another chef. One fucking soggy piece of toast. Off the deep end. I'm a bitch who kept the fucking station going. Y'all don't want to fucking save me. Fuck off. What the fuck? And with so much on the line. Where is it? Grab the pancake. Just pick whatever's left. The chefs will do anything to get ahead. Pancakes in the fucking trash. Even something so unthinkable. Jackery. They deserve better. Oh my God, if someone had eaten that, they would have died. So unforgivable. You fucking killed someone with that. That Chef Ramsay is left with no choice. I've never done this before. But to take immediate action. Fuck me. Oh, next time. Someone. On a truly shocking. Be going home. I'm gonna throw up. Hell's Kitchen.